Skyla Young, age 24, gunned down November 19th, 2023, in Lorraine, Ohio. Her husband, age 29, shot, killed her, their four-month-old baby, and her nine-year-old daughter in a murder-suicide. God bless the victim, and God bless their families. Damn. This is 29-year-old Tyler Young. Police say he shot and killed his wife, their infant son, her daughter, and then turned the gun on himself. Domestic violence is wrong. It's always wrong. Just don't do it. This to be a murder suicide. We understand that this is a familial issue sometimes. There, these are, there are things that happen within four walls that we can't always affect. Well, disturbing new information in Lorraine after an infant, child, and two adults were found dead over the weekend. Police are investigating the tragedy right now as a murder suicide. This is 29 year old Tyler Young. Police say he shot and killed his wife, their infant son, her daughter, and then turned the gun on himself. Around 10 Sunday morning, police got a call about the owner of Loose Dogs running in the street here near Broadway and East 9th Street in Lorraine. This address his neighbor say his dog's running the neighborhood that's unlike him. Haven't seen him since yesterday. When officers got to the scene and went inside the building and upstairs to the apartment, they found a man dead in the living room with a gunshot wound to the head and a 9 millimeter gun next to him. It was 29-year-old Tyler Young. Police say he shot himself. Officers also discovered his wife, 24-year-old Skylar Young, his four-month-old son, Bandon Young, and Skyler's nine-year-old daughter, Angel Isaac, all deceased with gunshot wounds. If you dealing with domestic violence, get out. Get out now. Get your kids and get out. Leave now. In a press conference, Lieutenant Jacob Morris said the entire community is grieving, including law enforcement. We really do, as even as police and as emergency services work together to rely on each other to hopefully curb things like this. And sometimes you can't, but in the same respect as, as officers, we hope to get out to our public that there is help out there. You're never truly at the end of your rope uh, and that there's always a way to, uh, to improve your life, so to speak. 19 News dug deeper and discovered Tyler Young had a history of domestic violence, even attempting to strangle Skyler when she was pregnant, the most recent incident just this past May. We talked with one woman who witnessed investigators on the scene Sunday and says she's devastated. And my heart goes out to the family and friends of all those people. Uh, it was a terrible, terrible incident. Investigators say Tyler did not leave a note, but police do say that family members reported that Tyler had a, quote, schizophrenic episode earlier this year and that they are looking into his mental health. Ladies, domestic violence is not a joke. Get armed and get trained. God bless the victim here and the family. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.